too. Uh, all right, guys. Let's go ahead and real quick. Boom, and we are ready. You guys are good. Yeah. So we'll see. We'll see. We'll see how it goes, man. That's mm. that's an upset. That's what hurts. Oh, that is definitely an upset. That's what hurts. All right, I'm gonna make the transition here in two, one, slide. There we go. Ooh. Okay, so Taiwan Man and Sukasa. Got it. I feel like the name, the tag, is like from an anime that I really can't remember. Probably. Right now. <laughs> it, like it, it's like one of those really strong anime wife, like baby's first waifu name. You know. You <laughs> <laughs> Shouts to anybody's baby's first wife. Mine was like C2. C2? Yeah, from Code Geass. When I was oh, I, was, I see, I see. I was conscious enough to understand, like, okay, this is what a waifu is. Like, back then, <laughs> it, it, back then it would have been Misty, like, for sure. Misty? Yeah. Not, not even May the Good? No, the dude. Good female? Yeah, it was a hard toss up between Misty and Sailor Pluto. Oh, I see. Yeah. Or Mars. Oh, one of the two. Anyways, let's get okay, into Okay, so the back. Yeah, anyways, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> back to the match at hand. So. So far, Taiwan Man is doing a really good job of just keeping um, Sukasa like at bay. Like you see, yeah, you see this situation like over and over again where his game is like stuck at the ledge. Oh, and you just missed that. Oh, that's a bit of a shield stand Oh, off. that almost killed. Oh, wait, wait, wait. See, at this point right here at the ledge, you really have to respect Samus on her car recovery because you can't just go full out there, try to go for a dare or a back air because her the way that she moves her hurt box mm -hmm. around with bomb ball is really cautious. So you have to wait for the actual landing. Mm hmm. And then not to mention, she also has, like, good um, options to get back up, like a charge shot, fair. It was born that up tilt, though. Pretty solid here. Mm. Taiwan, man, pretty close. Oh, that's big damage there. Oh, that was, there. that was a good hit. <gasps> You're running in, man. You really okay. have to be careful. Yeah, yeah. So at this point, Tsukasa's, like, caught on of um, Taiwan man's, like, approach patterns. Mm -hmm. He'll run until he's close enough to him that he can, like, try to jump fair. But Tsukasa's calling that out every time. Yeah. For Tsukasa, he, like, exactly, he tried to go for jump fair, but the problem is Tsukasa comes it up with a forward air. For him, for his opportunities to understand where's the commitment and where's the ability to commit, because even though Samus is really good at zoning, she's got some options wow. that are really laggy. There is this night, man, you never feel safe when she's around. True. Yeah, and Taiwan Man didn't really do anything to protect himself from that. He still had his jump. He had an air dodge. He had a counter. There was like a lot he could have done there. He just chose not to do anything. And Tsukasa doing a really good job of recognizing that he's not going to do anything in that situation and call him out with a charge shot. So it makes me wonder what uh, Taiwan Man's going to do now when he's in disadvantage. Yeah. I mean, he's down a whole stock. Solid option for him to understand the cross up, especially if he's going around. At this point, Taiwan Man's best opportunity here. He's got a little bit more respect. He's finally able to get it, and he gets a whiff punish there because he knew Sukasa's going to come in with that forward air, so you have to find the punish. There's another oh, one. I guess Upper. Mm. Okay, good, 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 good. Watch the shield pressure, oh, though. Oh, but he... So he did have an opportunity to try to close in the gap, but because his shield was low, he wasn't confident, so he chose to run away to recharge his shield, mm -hmm. and then that essentially just recreates the situation again for later. Okay, get back up. I like okay, it. Kind of holds himself neutral. Get up. No get up attack. I would have expected the get up attack there because it would have been not optimal mm. just to hit him away from you. Right. Oh, wait for it. <sighs> no, man, you gotta be careful. Okay, he's, he's still fine. Oh, that that's the out. problem, yeah, man. Yeah, so he keeps calling in the jump in approaches. Mm -hmm. Now we know, now we know how, uh... What? Now, now we know how he lost it, man. But I want to commentate too. Well, I have to hop off. I have a match. All right. But I'll, I'll be back as soon as I can. Yeah, you'll be back. I'll do this uh, classic Dodgers Vince Scully style. Anyways, like like uh, my good friend Not Last just said, he kind of called in the aerial approach. The problem was that he felt safe after the bomb ball that he might have been able to go in, but the problem is you kind of have to wait and see how Sam is going to start committing after her her projectiles. So that's one of those deals where like you really need to process like, okay, is it better for me to approach from the air or to stay grounded? And at this point, if you're being called out in the air, you're better off to stay grounded. Uh, but we'll see how we'll see how things go, man. We'll see how things go. Hopefully he makes some adjustments. Staying ground is definitely one of them. He got, had a lot of air time in the air to air. He was getting called out. Oh, there's dash attack. There's forward air. Solid up tilt there. I would have respect, respected the follow up at the forward air. Maybe go for a grab. Would have been much better. Forward throw. Then gets corner carry. Oh, there's the shield poke. I'm not going to lie. Oh, Taiwan man. You got to watch out. I'm not going to lie. At this point, what Taiwan man might be looking for is just those calls on the bomb ball. And he's finally able to get him. It's got him off stage. It went a little too hard with the neutral air. I respect it, though, because he saw the horizontal plane and he wanted to go for it. But you risk a lot for it. Good stall! Understanding how Samus likes to go for the downer. It's a classic, like, Wi-Fi Samus play. You go for the downer when your opponent's going to go low. Pretty good coverage. 
But so far, Sukasa kind of knows like I can also bomb ball, especially if he's gonna go that low, and then wait for the wait for the commitment. Solid stall with the charge shot at this point. Taiwan man finally working in neutral air. The back hit sends him to the other side. There's the corner carry. All right, you gotta watch out here. I see you can still recover. There you go. Back air. I will do it. Swipe left and give me the next light. Oh, okay, so apparently I am being told that these are USC and UCLA players. So this is a little bit of a... This is a bit of a... Collegiate battle here. I know, I know Taiwan man is from USC. There we go. All right, watch the landing for Sukasa here. At this point, he's trying to stall himself with the bomb ball. It's not gonna work. As was called, drag down fair. Wait, okay, I like it because he's able to go ahead and possibly go for a confirm with the drag down fair. The problem is he took a lot of time charge shotting, and since there was no tech, a tech chase would have been much better, especially with neutral air on that platform. It would have been much minus one. Finally gets the neutral air going after the down throw. Forward smash. Oh, you're still living there with good DI. Hold the jump there, and he's able to make the recovery. The one thing that I do like that some Samus's like to go for is they like to check the shield with the jab and then immediately go for forward smash, but at that opportunity, he kind of kind of... I like how he was able to force Taiwan Man to go for a roll get up because if he would have just gotten for neutral get up, he was afraid of the bomb balls, he was afraid of the jab, he was afraid of any other options, so he was forced to go for a roll. I, I definitely would have left to have seen a jump get up at that point and then go for downer because then he could cover any any option that Tsukasa might have been going for. Okay, wait for it. There's the four there. There's the call out. Oh, Taiwan man with shield here and he's got the pressure yet again. He's out of there. Alright, he's going to swipe. Taiwan man with the next chance of life here. Risky roll. I, I respect it, but it's still risky nonetheless. Could have gone and grabbed. Now he's starting to use down air, which is pretty good. It was buffed from the previous patch, not this current one, where it has a little bit less end lag. So it's a pretty solid option to go for, especially when you're pushing one above. Down throw, wait for, I like it. He even, he makes a solid call out there because he wanted to scare Taiwan Man from the neutral and the forward air. Oh man, he got, he got caught slipping there, trying to swing. Jump get up, you should have been more content with coming back on the stage. And Tsukasa finally wins this one with a 20 in the handshake. And that'll do it between the rivalry.